Right, so this is a fairly basic frame. It's got a plastic wood look, but it is glass here. Um, the, this back is okay for this frame because the, whatever you call it, fits within the frame. There are a lot that don't fit in the frame and aren't very useful because I know that people tend to hang their pictures on the wall rather than put them on a table. So this is okay. But what I do tend to do is rip off the support, sand it down to smooth it off, and then put a bit of tape over it just to avoid any damage to your painting without getting in a mess. And then turn it round so that you've got that on the inside. <coughs> So you've taken all your stuff out, all these little things are folded up. I would suggest that you take the glass or whatever it is out and give it a clean in just hot soapy water because they tend to come very dirty. You've got your mount and your painting, or in my case, a print. So the mount I've cut myself to fit this and you get it in the right position. Make sure you don't let it move. I haven't quite got that straight. I always put my name and the title and what it is on the back as well. Magic tape is the best thing to use rather than the masking tape you might use for the edges of your paintings. Excuse my fingernails, I've been printing today. <laughs> and what they call a hinge is the best way to put this on so you put the vertical one on and a horizontal one but not on your the paper of your painting but just on the mount this is a mount i cut myself which is why there are pay, pay, um, pencil marks all over it. So there you have your mounted painting with your name on the back. Drop it in, drop the back in, making sure that it's up the right way. Remove these things, which are difficult to remove. Now, I will talk about these lugs later on, but um, I find that the people I buy the frames from don't always put them in very carefully. And consequently, when I remove the glass, I can't get it back in. <laughs> okay, so that's fixed. You've got it up the right way, so that's good. The next thing to do is to put in I was going to put in here oh yes you may remember that I was going to put it in as a float so it just sort of sits on the mount card and again the magic tape I use sausages but you can use those little spongy things that have got sticky on both sides. So what is that tape effect on Becky? It's removable. Um, And the best way to remove tape anyway is to use a hairdryer so that you soften the glue. Right, so you put your mount in. The glass has already been cleaned. If you're going to put 
this in that way round. If you've got a painting, it might be an idea just to put a bit of extra barrier between that and your painting. Fold these lugs down. Then the next stage is getting your D-rings in. Now, I've done the drilling, Blue Peter style, but the best thing I find is to use something like this because it gives you a consistent measurement. And then make a hole. Like that. And then I usually get my husband to drill an extra hole because this being plastic, it's not very easy to screw into. And also you might stretch it and put it out of shape. So having done that, I've got the D-rings and the screws. Um, you might decide that you need an extra lug and I do have one of these exciting things put an extra one in, which is rather fun. <laughs> and I do pull out the ones that get put in bent. Um, I don't know if you can see that there, but it's extremely bent. And if you're taking the glass out and fiddling around and putting your mount in, these get in the way, so I've pulled those out. So the next thing is the tape. So I tend to just make it a little bit longer than the actual frame itself. And then make sure that it goes into the corner over the lugs and then just press it down and into the corner. This is, this is proper framers tape, and I have plenty of it if you want to buy some. Much cheaper than you'd get it at any of the art shops, because I buy it in bulk. So that's in the corner, and it seals the painting from all the rubbish that's in the air, dust and stuff like that which is why you need to make sure your glass is clean in the first place, because you don't want dust flecks showing up once you've done this. That one's not a very good one, but it's okay. So that's all nicely sealed now. So with your D-ring, there's a, a kind of raised bit just there. So you want that to be on the outside, not on the inside. These are cross-headed screws. This is the most frustrating bit. the raised bit on the top and it is the right way around fortunately <laughs> Then the cord. Now I burn the ends because otherwise it will fray endlessly. And I tend to have it double personally. 
get my husband to help me with a reef knot. Left over right and right over left, as you did in the brownies. I was just about to say that. <laughs> <laughs> so it would come out much tighter than that, and the cord would be shorter. With a box frame, you don't actually need all the tape and so on, but it's useful to put your name and the title and tape down the ends so that they're nicely packed away and look tidy. And that's about it, really. Um, I haven't put any on the back of that because it's not painted yet. So, what else do I need to mention? That's all. That's all. For a big old painting like this, I would put three sets of tape down to stick the painting to the back of the mount card. We need a label, don't we? You, you need a label. That's, that's, thank you. That was the bit I needed to mention. I didn't. Yes, you need a label. So, this is a recycled frame. So I haven't put the tape back on, but I have changed the label and I've tried to put it in the same place that the old label came off. I now order my frames without these things on, but they're quite useful for lifting the backing off when you want to get, get it out like that. So there's my name, the title of the painting. And it hasn't gone in very well because those little metal things are sticking out. And I use the bigger D-rings as well for the larger frames. The cord I get from the framers as well, and that, although that looks thin, it actually goes up yes, to 20 kilograms strong, or something. Yeah. Um, so it's, it's the correct stuff to use. And I have lots of it for you to buy if you want. We need uh, for the actual exhibition. You need a, like a luggage a label. label that yes. goes over the. That's yes. true for the yeah. for the exhibition. Tie it onto to your cord, possibly make it long enough so that it can be Hands seen on. at the front, with the same details: your name, the title of the painting, and the price, so that when it's hung, we can put the right card with the right painting and also for when they're sold so you've got the label yeah, there the, to yes. identify the yeah, sale so yes <laughs> right so that's it really okay <laughs> this thing it's it's cool isn't it it's cool yeah yeah tabs tabs not lugs yeah i must admit what i've been doing which I'm going to change now. But when I do those, yes, and you've got those bits, I put a piece of paper around there. Yes, I know. And it's, but it's fiddly doing it. Well, don't. You but don't. that that tape you've got, I should get some of that. Yes. And just to stick along there, it's just yes. so much so easier. It's so much easier. Job done. Yes, job done. I was getting the yes. fiddle with that. And also, there's the, always the chance of the person tearing your paper. Yes. Yes, no, I like that way. Right, you can always learn something, can't you? Oh, thank you. Yeah. Good. If anybody wants any cord or D rings or tape, I've got it here if you want to buy it. Selling all the, the little all the rings. Bits and pieces. Yes, selling I am. Them tonight, I mean. Yes, I am. What, okay. what do you need? Um, well, the actual little clips. The and, clips. Yeah, and uh, some string. Cord. Cord. Yeah, cord. Sorry. <laughs> cord. Not string. <laughs> That's what 
I move right. as well. Uh, the single ones like that, or the double ones like I have on here. Um, I think this, the single ones would be okay actually. Yeah. Because most of them are fairly small. Yeah. <coughs> can okay. I have two of each? Is that yes, right? yes, of course you can. Five metres of that on each one. Right. So they're 120 for those and two for those. Two, four, six, four, two. Right, so Greg, um, two D rings, two cords. So that's uh, two, four. Five, six, six forty, is that right? Yep. If I give you that, money. then, oh, then uh, you yes. give me a five, is that all right? No, right? I can't. Because oh. <laughs> I didn't think anybody was going to pay with money. Oh. Um, oh. Did, did you want I me to pay, pay with a card? No, no. Um, <laughs> I think I've only got a £10 note. Right. In Eleven forty. I think. I've, I've written it down. Oh, I have got, I've got, do you want me to get mine then? Okay. I've got to change. Make sure I've got enough room to Now, how much is that? How many of these did you get in one? Enough for five frames. Enough for five frames. Oh, well, I'll have one of each. I have that and the say and uh, the, the um, one of the cords. The cord. <laughs> yeah. <It's like> crazy. <laughs> <laughs> right. So that's three twenty, please. Right. Got the right money as well. Lovely. Thank you. Three twenty. Sorry, I can't go. remember your name. Jill. 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 J -I with, a, with a J. Yes. Thank you very much. My brother's chair. <laughs> ah. <laughs> but I was wrong first. I'll tell you what, I'll get my <laughs> husband to bring some change because we've got some at home. And uh, well, it's, um, you know, I'm sure you, you knew I've got it there, haven't you? Uh, You're not far off. One pound off. Thank you. Thank you. Is this other thing? I'm sure you're not going to leave the country. For the well, I wasn't planning it. <laughs> one pound. Oh, which one's for Betsy? Or do you want to hang on to that? And no, no, that's fine. No, yeah? Yeah, that's fine. Okay. Make sure you get your pound. Right, okay. <laughs> um, can I ask you... One pound flesh. Yeah. Shylock. Um, All right, thank you very much. This is... Okay. Uh, my my um, granddaughter bought me something. It's a bit like that. Oh, yeah. Can you use that for uh, just exhibitions? That yes. one? Yes. You just change it on? It's a bit. Oh but, oh, but then you don't have the glass, do you? You don't, no, but you would need to um, put some kind of finish on it. But that people sell paintings like this. With that glass on top? Yes, because it's not in a frame. Yes, that's right. That's what she's... So this would be okay for that, will it? Yes. Oh, yes. There's, oh, there's yes. The wooden, You've got that. There's the wooden frame underneath. I see. Yes. So you would you would do it about a third down, mm. um, about there. I see. Yes. Because you need it down enough so that that label, the you know the yellow sticky thing that goes on the board mm. with a hook on it, you don't want to see that. Oh, I see. So it so needs to be about a third down. Third down. Yes. Okay. And that can be just like that without any yeah. glass. So like that. That would go in an exhibition like that. I see, like that. And it's no glass. No glass. No. Right, I, I wasn't sure no. about that. But you go to... Even if you had... Some people put these into what's called a tray frame. So I don't know if you've seen them, but they... It's a bit like this, and you put the, put it in like that. Oh, right. Um, so it just sort of... Literally, it's a tray. Um, oh, I see, yes. But it still has no glass. Mm. So you wouldn't you wouldn't put glass on that. No, no, no. No, no because it's a canvas. Mm. So you don't yes. you don't oh, put glass oh, yes. on canvas. No, no, no. I see. You've got it like like that. Yes. yes. Thank you. Very All right. Much. <laughs> I'll see you soon. Okay. If any questions, you want to um, ask me. You, you can ask me. Yeah. 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 Yeah.
paid for everything so far except for the bill for the new um, I paid for the stickers that I the stickers, yes. In the Carl Shorter in the sun. In the sun, yes. Um and I paid for um because the post office in the uh, in the centre of Carl Shorter. That's what you said you paid for. Yes, no, those are the yes. only two I okay. paid for. Okay, because there are other things, aren't there? There's the um, wine with floor. Yes. And not there's much. No, and uh, Simon's Guardian. Guardian, yes. Yes. But so, everything else is um, on, the uh, the on the vellum. Yes. Yeah. So that I'll put that all on the spreadsheet and, and work out what everybody needs yes. to contribute to the pot. So yeah. you get your money back and the will yes. get their money. Yes. Okay. And um, if you put the um, your painting for the sun up into vellum, I'll take it in. Do you yes. want to do that, uh, or will you give it to Simon? I'll give it to Simon. Minute? He doesn't know about it yet. But okay, that's something else, Simon. <laughs> <laughs> Um, I'm away on the 12th, when we go to the Bellum uh, to the sun. Okay, well I'll ask Narendra then, if she's taking yours, she might as well take mine.